art by Inked Playmats at inkplaymats.com. Your place for custom-made playmats. Design your own or shop from other featured designers. Use promo code CLOTSDILL to save 10% on your order. Inked Playmats. Your game, your style. ...to do on their website and come join us for a fun-friendly F&M environment. Hello everybody, this is Kevin from Klotz Productions, and welcome back to Game 3 of the match between Fateful Hour and Niapod. Justin was on the play and started off with a copper line gorge, then David immediately went down to 18 to play a Gitaxian probe and look at Justin's hand, then he laid down a planes and passed. Justin put a force in the play and played a strangle root geist, then attacked with it for 2, taking David down to 16. David then laid down a swamp and played an immolating soul eater. Justin miracled a bonfire of the damned on his next turn for 1 damage to kill the soul eater and take David down to 15. He then attacked with his Geist again, taking David to 13. David played a Thraben Doomsayer on his next turn, and then Justin put a Cavern of Souls into play, naming Angels. He attacked with his Geist again, taking David down to 11. In post-combat, he played a Huntmaster for the Fells, going up to 22 and getting himself a Wolf Token. David played a Gavany Iron Rite, and then paid 4 more life to play a Dismember and kill the Huntmaster. Justin just played a Birds of Paradise on his next turn, so at the end of the turn, David made himself a Human Token with his Doomsayer. He then played another Iron Ride on his turn and then passed it back. Justin then played another Bonfire of the Damned on his turn for two, turning on the Fateful Hour but it didn't kill any creatures. Then at the end of the turn, David made himself another Human with the Doomsayer. Then on his turn, he played a Gather the Townsfolk to get himself five more Humans. He then attacked with his two Iron Rites and his first two Humans. Justin decided not to block and took the 18 damage, going down to four life. David then played an Elite Vanguard before passing his turn. Justin flipped over his top card as he drew it, but it wasn't the third bonfire of the damned he needed to win the game, so went ahead and scooped it up, giving David the win to the game and the match. So that's it for this match, I hope you all enjoyed it. You can find the full version of this gameplay in the annotations at the end, along with links to my blog and my Let's Play Duels of the Planeswalkers 2013. If you like this or any other video, be sure to give it a thumbs up and add it to your favorites, then subscribe to be notified when more videos are online.